So we've got our D chord here, and we've got our G chord, okay? And with that lifting and shifting idea, we can learn to move back and forth very quickly, okay, and accurately. So when we're playing... And that's what we're looking for. So once you've practiced your D and you've practiced your G and that sort of thing, then you start practicing common chords that go together by bouncing them back and forth, which is what I refer to as lift and shift. So hopefully that helps you a little bit in your practice. And again, if, you, if you're learning how to play open chords and you're struggling to a certain degree with um, you know, what kind of guitar you're using or the picks or the strings or various techniques that we can practice and discuss, check out my guitar course on open chords and you'll find the link below. Take care.